Hey gamers and YouTubers, and welcome back to part 2 of Mario and Sonic at the London 2012 Olympic Games. Uh, we're continuing Sonic's mode because, again, I'm a pretty big fan of Sonic, which is why, and guys, hit on me for this, I decided to get uh, this game over Super Mario 3D Land. I'll get that the minute I sell this, but still, you know, I mean, this is... I don't know, it's just, I thought it'd be so cool to play as Metal Sonic shooting guns, and Sonic running down tracks, and Tails playing badminton, apparently. Man, who knew ghosts could play badminton? It's pretty extreme. Um, okay. I see the game they're playing. They're playing badminton. I was playing sissy mitten, but okay. There we go, one up them. Oh, and Sonic does this epic pose with the racket. Uh, oh, okay. We don't even have to serve. Nice. Pew. 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 And double pew. There we go. Oh, it's not over. Wow, I look cool. Sonic looks suave. Smash. Smash. This game's sort of interesting to do with, uh, the touch screen and all. Just considering, like, half of the, uh, events require you to blow or, like, move the control or the, uh, 3DS. So, yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. Although it's a little hard to film because of that. So, luckily we're getting events that don't require too much crazy mo motion and action. There we go. We won. We rocked it. Cutscene time, it looks like. Well, we beat the booze. Ooh, he's sassing his boss. Okay, then. Well, now that they're done, I guess we'll chase them into the sunset. Or whatever us, uh, hedgehogs do. Ooh, did we just find the gas machine? I think so. Let's thump it. Yay! Team Sonic for the win. Tails, that was the silliest thing you could ever say. You want to see what makes it tick? Maybe a hedgehog rolls up into a ball and smashes it. I mean, come on, man. There we go. We cleared up foggy London. Well, as much as, uh... It can be cleaned up. I mean, come on, it's, it's London, it's always foggy. Let's get real. From all those years of smog and children working in factories, and wow, that joke was not politically correct. So, thank you for watching, be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe below, and uh, thanks for watching.